Still, still, I still can't believe this is the first film you picked out of the genre films. Mm -hmm. Is the genre films there? Yeah. We've still got the genre films. <laughs> is right. Is Charlene Woodley earlist? I don't know. I don't think she is. I'm the same as her. There's nothing I could imagine worse than going to something like that. Especially if you have someone like that. I mean, it's all in good spirit, I guess. <gasps> I just realised who that is. We don't like you on this channel, Laura Dern. Is it awesome? You didn't let that go. Nope, never. Yeah, Mom, it was awesome. No, it wasn't. No, the last Jedi was not awesome. Shut up. <sighs> Sean. Ha! <laughs> He's a charmer. Mm. What? It's just how I, I struggle with cringy stuff. It was it was it was cute cringy though, it wasn't like cringy cringy. He banged into the door because he like he was enjoying looking at her. I know. Isn't that not cute? It's still like I don't know how I would react in that situation in real life. I would probably cringe. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, they go to Amsterdam, don't they? That's right, yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to go to Amsterdam. I'm going to go to Amsterdam at some point. Amsterdam? Yeah. She's like, oh, take that, bro. Yeah, and he's just serious hard eyes. Yeah. <sighs> this is cringy as well. Like that is probably the most pretentious thing I've ever heard. No, uh, I've made plans with Augustus' daughters. Yeah, I'm not sure that's entirely true either. I'm pretty sure they still do damage even if they're not lit. You don't say. I imagine so. Not as much damage as they do when you're actually small with them, but still do damage. I bet me and him would be good friends. But not like that, trust me. It's it's amazing. What, you don't think I'd be friends with? His name is Peter Van Houten. He's the only person I've ever come across. I'd be friends with him. You're allowed to talk, you know. I know. I just um I don't know what to talk about in this kind of movie. Fine. No, they're cute. They're not cute. And neither are you, Laura Dern. Sean. You don't ruin this movie because you don't like Laura Dern. It's such a shame because I used to love Laura Dern. She was in Jurassic Park. You didn't even put like a, a witty thing in the title. Oh I couldn't think of one. The Fault in Our Streams? Toss a coin to your streamer. I think I thought that was. Oh, for God's sake. You bottled that one. Oh, he hasn't texted her yet. Oh, look, she's all giddy. Oh, she's finally texting her. Look, she doesn't want to talk to them. She wants to talk to her new boyfriend. Mm -hmm. 
That's not funny. What? People who end a book in the middle of a sentence should be sh killed. I don't know how I'd feel about someone using my middle name though all the time like that. Not Katie Sarah. Eh? Uh? Is your name Sarah? No. Louise. Louise. I don't know how I would feel about if someone was like Katie, Katie Louise. <laughs> Imagine Katie if Louise. they did mine. Sean, or Sean and your David James. Yeah. Yeah, it would feel weird. No, we don't. No, we don't. Isaac. Yeah. Why? Do you? Oh, yeah, he's just been dumped, hasn't he? I hope you will not mind that he showed that you know him. That's not cool. I was wondering if you wouldn't mind answering a few questions I have about what happens after the end of the book. Specifically the following. Does Anna's mom marry the Dutch tulip man? Oh, it's cute. They touched hands. Oh, look, it's Buffy and... and Angel. Angel, that's the one. I was going to say Angel. <laughs> Depends. Depends, Ray. Kate, it does. You like love, lovey dovey stuff. You like Nicole, don't you? Yeah. You like cringy love stories. Um, I don't hate love stories. There's just certain ones that I don't like. I'm very picky about the films that I like and don't like. That's my. You problem. like Notting Hill? That's a love story. Because Notting Hill is one of the best rom coms that's ever been made. Notting Hill is the standard for all rom coms. That was when Hugh Grant was at his absolute best. I can't believe I have a crush on a girl with such cliche shaped wishes. Terrible. Yeah, the Twilight series is already in there, rare. Uh, I really do not want to watch any of them. Fifty Shades of Grey. Well, oh. I hate those things. I hate those things. Really dislike them. Is that for your brain? MRIs are for your brain, aren't they? Aren't they? I, th oh, I think so. I'm not sure. Oh, look, they're all friends. Nobody cares about you, Laura. <laughs> Find this movie. Oh, again with the middle name. I don't like it. I don't like the middle name thing. If you kick that desk one more time, I'm going to chop your leg off. What's that other one? A walk to a remember. That's the one that we have to watch. That's one that everyone always loves. I like a walk to remember. That's a nice one. That's all about being... It's one of those 90s movies where the unattractive girl falls in love with the 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 sort of mm. the rebel jock kid. Oh! Ah, oh, look, she can't get her words out. Isn't that cute? <laughs> Stop it, Laura Dern, I don't like you. Stop it. Right. Mom, I oh, bless her. Was this a popular book before the film came out? Yeah. I don't think it was. I think it was. I don't think it was. Not like Harry Potter was a popular book mm. when it came well, out. It's not that level, it's still a popular book. See, I don't like needles, but the thought of having like a tube inside me. If ever I'm like in the hospital, don't let them put one of those things inside my hand. An IV? Yeah. No. 
I don't know any other way to say this movie. It is too sick. No, no. So I would just be like, right, well, we don't want to stop, stop the treatment then. Well, I mean, I wouldn't go that far, but it's... No, a... if, I can't, if I can't live my life and I'm going to have to sit in a chair and have all this medicine pumped into me and I can't do anything, I don't want to be... I don't... God, I hate when they do that flashback of when she's a child in the bed and they're telling her to let go. Just, just, just because chil children, the idea of children dying is upsetting. Yeah, upsets me. It is. It's just like it just pulls at the heartstrings. It's sad, but I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't understand why she, why she says, "Oh yeah, you can let go," and then sit there and go, "I'm not gonna be a mom anymore." It's like you're not the one dying. Yeah, but she's losing her child, her only child. I saw how you spell pedophile. No. 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 Mm. Yeah. That's not the kind of swing set you want for your kids. And it's not how you spell pedophile. It's pedophile. See, Raymond will know, right? Because Raymond is from Europe. As compliment score, that was quite a good one. Um, Americans don't know how to speak. I know, I know. Um, sorry, I was too busy agreeing. That was nice. I like that bit. Um, what was I saying? Americans don't know how to speak. I always dislike it when it's the UK versus US things. Because Americans try to go, oh no, well that, that's this thing, man. That's how. That's why you say it like that, man. And they're like, no, you do realize, you Americans are actually speaking English. We just, we just. You realize that most of our audience are Americans. Yeah, we. <laughs> <laughs> we define. You know that Americans don't speak normal, Raymond. Americans have a thing. Americans have a thing. It's just, I really like Americans. I really like them. I don't want them to hate me, but they don't know how to speak English. <laughs> and that's what they speak. They speak English. We're going. <laughs> well, she's just taking a bath. <laughs> <laughs> She'll be all wet and. Uh... Yeah, exactly. I mean, I'd, I'd hit her in the sweet moment, but she has just taken a bath. Yeah, she's probably all stinky. Because she's stinky. Laura Dern. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> yeah, they speak English, and they, they put in some of their silly little words and say, oh, we're, we're actually speaking New American. And like, you're not, you're speaking English. <sighs> Would you stop upsetting everyone? <laughs> the Americans know I'm saying it in jest. Thank you, my our colonial friends. Worry. I have I have an have Oxford to... English dictionary around here somewhere. Dutch? Are you Dutch? I think Raymond's Dutch. You're Dutch, Raymond, aren't you? I wouldn't even know where to begin with Dutch. Like seriously, half of the German language is just looking angry, right? Half of the French language is just looking pretentious. But I wouldn't even know where to begin Why? with Dutch. <laughs> yeah, uh, Australians. Sean. What the Australians? Chill out. What the blue hell? Do Australians speak? I'm trying to watch the movie. Shut up. <laughs> Me and Ray were just whinging about languages. <laughs> I thought you were, Ray. Wow, yeah. <laughs> a bit of an Australian it, apparently. I think I'm reading apparently we have a bit of an Australian English. <laughs> we don't. We're Northern English. Shut up. Hey. This is me doing us do your Australian. Do your Why? Australian accent. Why? Just do it, it's funny. No. <laughs> Come on, do your Hugh Jackman impression. No oh, no, we're not offended at all. We're northern English though, that's what we are. That's yeah, prohibited, you douche. 
Um, because we have to make it at least some light entertainment. I've already insulted half the world. Speaking of half the world, Portuguese. Shut up. <laughs> Favourite teams in football, Raymond, not soccer, is uh, Sunderland. League One, English. Not very good. <laughs> Spanish, yeah. Tell me about it, Ray. Gosh, those Spaniards. Would you two be here? <laughs> <laughs> you two, Ray. The Spanish, they just, they just think they're the best. And they're not even. That's why they talk so damn quick. This is supposed to be a sad movie. It hasn't gotten to the sad bits yet. The sad bits is when he's dying, not when she's dying. Oh, look how pretty she is. Heart eyes. The I art like of acting is in the eyes. I like when I like when actors can do good heart eyes. I'm gonna say something controversial. Right. She would have been a better Mary Jane than Kirsten Dunst. Do you know why? Because mm. Kirsten Dunst is a terrible actor. <laughs> <laughs> I genuinely, and I'm not saying this to be divisive. I genuinely, but when people when people in Europe are speaking English, I struggle to recognise where they're from, mm. unless it's like completely obvious. Like if it's German, like you know, if someone's German, that's a bit free stuff. Is everywhere in in uh, do you know what country Dutch originates from? <laughs> Katie doesn't know where Dutch is. Do you know what country it's in? What country they speak Dutch? Why did you do this to me? Do you not? Ray's the only one who always tunes in. He's Dutch and you don't know where he lives. That wasn't really good at geography, I Oh my word. Do you? Yes. Holland? I, I mean that. The Netherlands? <laughs> This is uh, one of our. Lena play Bumfer Lala. This is one of our dogs. This is the one we call the fat one. The lump. This is Arch. I tried to lift them with my hand and couldn't do it. Oh, bless her. Mm. William Defoe is really good at being a villain, isn't he? I know this movie doesn't necessarily have a villain, but if it did. I mean, really, the villain here is cancer, isn't it? But he is definitely you stop to ask yourself why a you secondary so much about your silly questions. I'll go fuck yourself. Ha! <laughs> well said. Now we're just going soccer one right on the jaw. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if people think that's actually how I talk. I don't actually talk like that. I talk like that on the stream so people okay. who don't speak my language it's can okay. understand me. Oh, well. Redheads are always cool. Despite what people say. Just stop stereotyping people. <laughs> I'm afraid there's no elevator. Bless her. And she wasn't getting any grief. Off. Oh, yeah. what, I mean, Dutch people must be nice. Oh, I feel like they must be. I mean, after being an animal, it gives, it gives her grief. <laughs> I think we know a certain uh, group of people who would. Cause I want to, I want to see this in the cinema of school. Did you? Your school <laughs> took you to see this yep. in 2015. Yep. Wouldn't like didn't Age of Ultron come out in 2015? And they took you to see this. What a sad school. Yeah. We know how to motivate our children. Thirteen-year-old me. Break their hearts. Christmas tree. Oh, it's there. Yeah, but he's it's there. But 
there. Mm -hmm. oh, no. He's lost his eyesight, so all his other senses of maybe he's heightened. maybe he's like Matt Murdock. No, it's not that cool. It doesn't matter nope, where Monica is. Okay, it's not about I just feel like she's gonna you. be okay. I wanted to buy cigarettes. I don't know what happened in my pack. I and mean, they might I might have lost it or something, or they took it. But I just I wanted to do something for myself. You know, I wanted to do it myself. Please, I have to call 911. No. I have to. No. Sure. Come to my house with robot eyes, and they tell me to try them on. I'm gonna tell those scientists to piss off, cause, cause Gus, I don't even want to see a world without you. I don't. I don't want to see a world without Augustus Waters. Cause there's really no one else. Stop staring at me while I'm crying your way out. Oh, bless you. I'm not going to talk about our love story because I can't. So, <laughs> instead, I'm going to talk about men. You gave me it forever. Within the numbered days. And for that, I am... I'm eternally grateful. Nice, Jesus. I think it's a bit worse. Because that was the last. That's oh, the minute. Oh my god. I'll do this when I watch the green marmite. I know, so I'm getting it out now. <laughs> I'm trying to dry up my tears. <laughs> you know, I'm always worried that when I'm going to go for a medical one day, they're going to think that there's something wrong with my hand because I don't have this bone. These people do. Every single person I've seen. It. That bone there. See that? I can't do that with my thumb. Show the people. I only have one. Hold you, no, hold them up that way. So you say on Kitty's... Which one is it? On that hand there. I don't have that bone on the thumb. It's just... That's all I can do. I don't see the point of this. Huh? I don't see the point of that. Why would he call her his, his special friend? Why don't you call him his girlfriend? Who knows? Imagine wearing white at a funeral. Who wears white at a funeral? Willem Dafoe, obviously. <laughs> yeah, he does strike me as the type. Either white or green. I feel like he would wear green at a funeral. Mr. Van Houten. I'm a good person, but a shitty writer. You're a shitty person, but a good writer. I think we'd make a good team. I don't want to ask you for any favors, but if you have the time, and from what I saw, you have plenty. Okay, Hazel Grace? Okay. Oh, the pain. <laughs> oh, God. Oh you put that in there. Did you put that in there? No. I, think I didn't there. put that in That wasn't my writing. You absolutely did. I didn't put that in there, Sean. Yeah, I right. know for a fact I didn't put that in there. You must have done. I put movies in there that, I, that would pain you, not pain me. There's not very many movies that can pain me. As in, you, you'd be uncomfortable watching them, like rom-coms and crap. I don't mind watching rom-coms. Ones that I watch. They must always. The only thing with rom coms is they must always accept and acknowledge oh. that they will never be as good as Notting Hill. <sighs> Such is the way of life. Do you like you cry at the point that your throat hurts? Yeah. No. 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 There's not many. But I don't remember a film that ever made me cry like that. I don't. No, I wasn't there yet, but that was what it was like the first time I watched no, it. No, don't you. I hope you pick the same thing up. No, because it's lines. This could be one of mine, though. Oh. What? Is it one of the thieves? No! What is it? It's Indiana Jones and the Raiders of the Lost Ark. How do you know it's the Raiders of the Lost Ark? Because I've just put Indiana Jones. We'll put it back in. And every time we pick it out, we'll watch the next one. 
And the first one is Indiana Jones Raiders of the Lost Ark. Oh my god. It's been, uh, to be fair, it's been so long since I've seen the Indiana Jones movies. But yeah, next Friday. I'll see you next Friday. Thank you, Ray, for watching. Like the video when it becomes a video. Subscribe, ding the bell to be notified when we upload. We upload every day. And we also stream every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. Um, and our, what's our rotor again? Ray came up with our rotor, didn't he? Monday, anime day. Wednesday, yeah. live action series yeah. day. Friday is just regular movie watching. Sunday is challenge day. Yeah. Okay. And this Sunday, we're going to be watching The Green Mile. And it's trying not to... It's not even trying not to cry. It's trying not to... I'm not allowed to wipe my face. Yeah, you're not allowed to wipe your face. I'm going to watch The Green Mile for that one. I'm just going to turn into a puddle. <laughs> it was mom and everyone's been saying, Oh, you'll sob, you'll cry. It's really you will. Amazing. You will. You'll fail the challenge. Um, Total Recall is a hard film to watch. Way more hard. It's about that, but times five. Um... Mm. But I'm a wimp. Yes, yeah, so an emotional know. wimp that can't handle stuff like this. There we go. So yeah, thanks for watching, Ray. <sighs> See you on Sunday. Brilliant. I need to know.